and Julia Sondu, showing you where development is happening. Please come and join us. Who are the richest Hausa and Fulani men in Nigeria? List of richest Hausa and Fulani men and their net worth. Below is the roll call of richest people in northern Nigeria, and areas dominated by Hausa and Fulani tribes. Some of these richest Hausa Fulani men in Nigeria are very popular and well known because of their entrepreneurs' prowess and achievements. Without taking much of your time, we will be listing the top wealthiest men from the north. The list consists of 10 Hausa and Fulani men who are among the richest in northern Nigeria through established business. Here is our latest top 10 richest Hausa and Fulani men in Nigeria, as at April 4, 2022. Number 1. Iliko Dangote. Net worth, $17.8 billion. Mr. Dangote is a member of the Fulani tribe from northern Nigeria, one of the largest tribes in the nation. Iliko Dangote is the richest Hausa man in Nigeria. Not only is he the richest Hausa Fulani man in Nigeria, but he is also the richest man in Africa with a net worth of $17.8 billion as of 2022. Iliko Dangote is a top businessman in Nigeria. He's the richest man from the region as well as the continent as a whole. Number 2. Abdul Samad Rabiu. Net worth, $6.1 billion. Abdul Samad Rabiu is the second richest man in the northern part of Nigeria and also he is the third richest man in Nigeria and according to Forbes he made it on the 16th spot of the richest men in Africa. Abdul Samad Rabiu is the founder and CEO of Bua, a conglomerate that is into agriculture, logistics, manufacturing, infrastructure, and port operations. Mr. Rabiu is also the chairman of the Nigerian Bank of Industry. Abdul Samad Rabiu was born on 4 August 1960 in Kano State. Abdul Samad Rabiu studied in Kano State during his early days. He studied economics from Capital University, Columbus, Ohio, the USA where he bagged a bachelor's degree. Number 3. Ibrahim Badamasi Babangida. Net worth, $2.5 billion. Ibrahim Badamasi Babangida is a businessman and politician who served as Nigeria's military president from August 1985 to August 1993. Born 17 August 1941, former President Ibrahim Badamasi Babangida is a native of Niger State. He also owns 65% of the London-based Frutex International Limited in London, 24% of Nigeria's second-largest telecom company, Globacom. Ibrahim Babangida net worth. Ibrahim Babangida is not only famous amongst Nigerians, but he is also wealthy. His net worth is estimated at $2.5 billion. Number 4. Theophilus Danjuma. Net worth, $1.5 billion. In 1975, Theophilus Yakubu Danjuma was the Nigerian Army Chief of Army Staff from July 1975 to October 1979 and also a Minister of Defense under Alusagun Obasanjo. On 24 April 1964, Theophilus Danjuma won the Nigerian National Boxing Championship. He later helped found a local minor soccer league. Danjuma is currently chairman of South Atlantic Petroleum, a company with interests in oil. Number 5. Atiku Abu Bakar, net worth, $1.4 billion. He is another influential and wealthy president of Nigeria. Born on 25 November 1946 to a Fulani farmer father and a trader mother, Atiku Abu Bakar is a native of Adamawa State, Nigeria. He served as the vice president of Nigeria from 1999 to 2007, with Alusagun Obasanjo as president. For 20 years, Atiku Abu Bakar worked as the controller general of the Nigerian customs. During his tenure as the controller of the Nigerian customs, he founded the logistic company Nigeria Container Service, Intels. In addition, he has a wide range of businesses from beverages, food, education etc. He has four wives and 28 children. Atiku Abu Bakar net worth. From numerous business engagements, Atiku Abu Bakar has amassed a fortune. Adama Beverages Company, the official name of the beverage company, 
is a well-known and valued manufacturer of all brands of different brands of bottled water and fruit juice. Sachet water pouches, table water, 20 LTRS dispenser jar bottles, and fruit juices are manufactured and distributed by the company in the northern states and nearby countries. Adama Beverages Limited is wholly owned by Atiku Abu Bakar. Number 6. Alhaji Dihiru Baru Mangal. Net worth $1.2 billion. The renowned philanthropist has featured in the book, Who is Who in Africa, several times. The World Financial Magazine, Forbes, back in 2010, listed him among the wealthiest people on earth. Also in the same year, the Time Magazine mentioned him among the 1,000 most influential people on the planet. The Katsina born billionaire has already carved a niche for himself in both the country's business and political rings. The mogul is estimated to have a net worth of around 850 million US dollars. He has plethora of businesses, ranging from oil and gas, to construction and aviation. He is the leading shareholder in Oando and Mrs. Oil and Gas companies. His company Max Air is the sole licensed company that has been transporting Nigerian pilgrims to Mecca, Saudi Arabia. He was regarded as the silent de facto president, during the late Yarajua's tenure, he is the biggest ally of late president, and had made influence in the appointments of many people into his cabinet. Since 1999 to date, Alhaji Dihiru Mangal has maintained his dominance in the politics of Katsina state and Nigeria in general. He still remain the number one power broker in the state. Number 7. Ali Modu Sheriff. Net worth $800 million. He was born in Ingala Town, Ingala local government area, Borno State in 1956. His father was the business tycoon Galadima Modu Sheriff. He attended government secondary school, Barma, 1974 to 1979. He attended the London School of Business, where he studied insurance, banking and finance. In 1981, he joined his father's construction company as a director, later becoming managing director. In 1985, he registered his first company. His companies include Maroyal Organization and Union Chase. He was elected as a senator from Borno during the Third Nigerian Republic under the banner of NRC. His opponent then was Kolo Kingiba, wife of the Social Democratic Party, SDP chairman, Babagana Kingiba. He was also a member of the Constitutional Conference and chaired the Committee on States and Local Government. Number 8. Sani Bello. Net worth $780 million. He is the founder of Amni International Petroleum Development Company, an oil exploration company with a 50% interest in the Okoro Setu oil field, located in shallow water offshore Nigeria. Amni shares ownership of the Okoro Setu field with London-listed exploration firm Afrin. Production averages 18,200 barrels a day. Bello is also a minority stakeholder in mobile telecom firm Mountain Nigeria. He is a former Nigerian military governor from Kano State and a one-time ambassador to Zimbabwe. His Sani Bello Foundation provides small loans and grants to young Nigerian entrepreneurs. Number 9. Muhammad Indimi. Net worth $450 million. Muhammad Indimi is one of the richest House of Fulani men in Nigeria and his company has interests in the Nigerian oil sector. He's the founder and chairman of Oriental Energy Resources, Limited. Muhammad Indimi founded the company in 1990. In 1994, Muhammad Indimi started a division that sells petroleum products. In 1996 Muhammad Indimi started a division that manufactures and sells air conditioners. Number 10. Alhaji Owalu Abdullahi Rano. Net worth. $280 million. He popularly known as A.A. Rano. He is an elite businessman. He is the chairman of the A.A. Rano Nigeria Limited. He was born in Lawzu village in Rano local government area of Kano State, Nigeria in the year 1944. He started his oil business in the year 1994 when he opened his first filling station after leaving his tractor business. A. Irano went through various ups and downs before he got where he is today in his business. 
He incorporated Arano Limited in the year 2002. A. Arano Nigeria Limited has a slot of fuel distribution stations scattered around the country. It's hard for a Nigerian or anyone who reside in Nigeria will tell you that he, she has never heard about their filling station or even seen their tankers that transport fuel. His company AA Rano Nigeria Limited has over 600 trucks and 115 retail outlets in Nigeria. This is the end of our program today. See you on Intervlog same time tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates. Thank you for watching Intervlog. Thank you.